Hello everybody, welcome to GeoGuster with the Streams of Anne's crew. We have Azarath here. Greetings. And Matt. Rejoice. Caucus. Do 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 lady 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 and this one's been a long time coming, submitted by user Fred. I think it was to my YouTube channel. Hi, Fred. Remember. Yes, Fred with a PH. In two Ds. And two Ds, yes. So thank you, sir, for so or madam, for submitting this uh, challenge. The link will be in the description below. If you guys want to play along with us, make sure you set a two-minute timer because this does use the retro GeoGuessr and there is no timers built in. So two-minute timer per round. Time is yes. the scrubs. Are you guys ready? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Three, two, one, go. Man, I love being sleep deprived. It's, it's just best. Like, you know, everything is funny. Everything. Like, like look at this stone. Giggle at that stone. Okay. I. Someone will know what this thing is, and that someone will uh, win. And I shall lose. Okay. Um, Italiano. Uh, de non, non te. Panini, and so it's Italy, uh, and Dragora, and, and, and Dragora, do I, okay, let's, uh, I'm going to get there, uh, sort of preliminarily, Andragora, is there a place called Andragora, uh, I feel like where, wherever this is, I don't think this is Rome, uh, in, in Italy, Tulks has been to, I think it's beautiful. Wow. Uh, Tulkas has been to Tarquinia and Rome. And this is neither of those. Um, La Cathedral. Oh. This is, this place is cool. That is not Rome, though. I think I probably would have noticed this if it was in Rome. Because this is nothing if not noticeable. Uh, let's go We. We, okay, no, go this way. No, 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 shoo. Freedom, liberty, tyranny is dead. Go, I'm claimed by the streets. Is, that's watchtower, that's a uh, clock tower. I feel like I saw that clock tower somewhere. Could be insane, though. Uh, the, what is the Roman police called again? I don't know, remember. I don't even remember. It's been the, the Carabari, the Cabazaneri. I remember my uh, classics teacher was talking about how uh, she would um, have an eye out, eye out for the Galileo. Uh, he was in Florence, I think. Florence, I, I believe. Time's up, make a guess. Oh my god, I was so worried about that one. Woo! I That's saw close. <laughs> every language of every kind. There was... I mean, at first I saw English, and then I saw a lot that looked kind of Italian. So I was pretty convinced it was Italy. But right then, there was a store that had, like, all Korean or Chinese. I don't know. And then I go further down, there was Russian. And I don't know. I, I, I was pretty... I saw more, more Italian than anything else. So I guess near Naples and got 24-7. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, 2,470. How'd you do, Al? I guess in Bologna, because I couldn't figure out which city it was, but it seemed like northern Italy to me. So I ended up with 34.49. Nice. Um, Matt? I was between Florence and Rome, just because they're the only things I have remotely any familiarity with. And I got managed to walk my way around to the other side of that stand that had like the messy shirt and all that other junk on it. And I saw a sign that said Florence on it, and I placed it there right as you were telling us to make our guess. I got oh, wow. 5729. Nice. nice. How'd you do, Tagus? So I thought it was pretty clearly Italy. It's that, that's sort of like the, those streets. Like, that doesn't look like anywhere else. That's a distinctly Italian look. Um, and I was originally going to guess near Naples, but at the very last second, I saw a uh, giant sign for the Museo Galileo. And I knew that Galileo did a lot of his uh, thingies in Florence, and so I guessed Florence for 6316. 
Nice. nice. Holy cow, we all guessed Italy. Well done. Yeah, we got in the right country. <laughs> all right, round two. You guys ready? Yes. Yes. I'm not. I had the wrong timer going, by the way. Now I got the right timer. Three, two, one, go. Yeah, I, I've been to Italy, though, so it's sort of cheating. Uh, over to NASA. Um, to, to, to continue on the story, uh, the, the teacher... Oh, Kennedy Space, that is Florida. <laughs> uh, that near Disneyland, wasn't it? In Orlando? Yes. Yes, Kennedy Space Center. Where? where? Because Court, Kurt was planning on going there. Was he not... Uh, like, like, for the, like, have, like, a vague excursion of Farlanders to the place. Am I saying? Okay, so, preliminary guess, there. I'm gonna find this thing. It ain't gonna be me. Well, it's pretty far out from, uh, the, the place. Uh, ESPN, Wide World of Sports. Disney's, ooh, Disney. All, all Disney's. Um, to, to continue on the, the story I was telling about my, uh, my, my classic teacher, I don't think, uh, she, she informed us that she was going to ha ha be keeping an eye out for the Italian police while she um, accepted the many streams of marijuana that the locals were surely to uh, ply her with out of sheer generosity. And I was rather taken aback by this, but it's not there, actually, because it's Indiana Avenue, woo! Um, yeah, that, that, that's the story that the, uh, the, the professor is keen on the marijuanas. It was a, a, an interesting tour group to go with, if I do say so myself. Do I, like, see anything? Do I, like, see anything? Is there, it's like, a, a rocket? Uh, is that, like, a KSC? Kennedy Space Center. We're just going long, going long, going on. Okay, we got to the place. Um... I, at this point, I don't think it's likely for me. Time's to, up. Make a guess. I will find it. I just turn to you. Okay. Hmm. Okay. So, I couldn't remember whether the damn Cape Canaveral was on the Gulf side or the ocean side, but I eventually found it on the ocean side. Um, I couldn't find the Kennedy Space Center. I guess I was actually looking near Port um, uh, Cape Canaveral and not on the main island at all. So I got fifty four twenty three. How'd you do, Al? I guess a bit far east in the very last second as I found Cape Canaveral. Um, I couldn't remember for sure where in Florida it was, so I kind of had the same issue. I ended up with sixty one fifty nine though. And Matt. So fun fact: I have been to Kennedy Space Center in Cape Canaveral, Florida, but I was like six, and I don't remember which side of the state it was on. So I plopped it in Orlando and was just trying to look for some kind of hint, but 3589. Oh, boy. And what's interesting is, is Kennedy Space Center is on NASA Parkway, and in in Clear Lake, where the um, Johnson Space Center is, uh, where NASA actually is, that road is also NASA Parkway. They're not really creative in their roads, are they? No. <laughs> uh, talk us how you do. Uh, Orlando, 3618. Nice. All right, next round. You guys ready? Yes. 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 Three, two, one, go. It's interesting that there's a whole causeway for NASA. It's very dedicated, I guess, in Florida. I've been to Florida once when I was six, uh, similarly to Mad in the Hat. Do not go to Orlando, though. It was just a, a wind break thing and stuff. Um, I've not been here, I don't think. It better not be a place I've been. Uh, so the, the I look at this test has failed me. Um, so this is Def UK, obviously, obviously. Um, if I, if I have a name, I will probably know where it is, because, you know, I've been everywhere that there is in this, well, not, not everywhere, I have, if it's Manchester that I've been there, so, you know, okay, 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 you, you can do this, man. Oh, the, the sign, World Heritage Site, yeah, that, Durham, 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 okay, it's Durham. I've, 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 I know vaguely Durham is a thing, but whereas I've, I've seen the word, I know the word Durham. This, ah, I've been to this place that is Durham. Okay. <sighs> why, why, why do I, why does my knowledge forsake me? This is, I'm like 80% sure this is Scotland. I guess near Edinburgh. 
Uh, yeah, here we are. Okay. Okay, Durham Cathedral is here. And the Durham Cathedral is there. Uh, return to start location. Uh, so, like, Durham Cathedral, like there. And then, like, on, like, the, the thing, like, starts there. Like, comes down. We're, like, here. I think. Am I insane? I may be insane. No, we're, we're, like, we're, like, here. Right. Because we're, like, here. Yes. And the almshouse is, is here. Like, probably. University police office? Where, where, where's the university? No, the, the university police office. It's, it's more right, like... time's up. Make a guess. No. I'm pretty sure we've been there before. I couldn't remember where Durham was. Yeah, I don't. I didn't know either. So, um, I just guessed, uh, where did I guess? Uh, north of Oxford. I got 2672. How'd you do, Al? I'm guessing you're London, 2524. And Matt? Uh, outside Birmingham, 2683. Focus. Uh, 6477. You've been you got there? it in Durham. Yep, yep, yeah, he's yep. been there. Yeah, well, <laughs> uh, like, you know, the... I'm not sure, I don't think I've been there. I didn't recognize that place, but um, I, I may have been there. You know, I've been many, like I could have been there when I was like six months old, which is when I first went to uh, the UK. But I, I just zoomed in, saw the cathedral. It was happy. Have we done that one before in GeoGuessr? I, I don't not, think we've done that exactly. No. I do not believe so. Hmm. I think we actually had one over um, like in Western. Okay. Like on the main island. Yeah. But I don't think we had that one in particular, as but far it, as castles go. But yeah, that's um, Durham is south of the border, and I've only been south of the border two times. Uh, once when I was in fifth grade to go to Hadrian's Wall, and once to uh, visit Manchester to behold the sheep. <laughs> behold. Also, All right, behold hi, Kenya. You anyway. guys ready? Yes. Yes. Three, two, one, go. I think that's Kenya. It could be South Africa. Um... We'll say I would say to Kenya to throw them off the scent if it turns out to be South Africa. And if it turns out to be uh, Kenya, then we'll say something else. We do Sim Shop. Or this might not even be. Uh, this, is, this is. Better be Kenya or something. Twa Shane. Yeah, that's the name of the place. Well, the, in well, the English suggested it's South Africa, and I'm just cray. Um, Uh, boy, Zumbayaya. So this is also let's, let's move wrong, move along. Minotoria. Um, this is the part where well, I suppose this part where knowing like what things are helps. Uh, go back one, back one. Together we can. Van der Walt Street. I mean, what's where the. I mean, this could be another country entirely, but I think it's. Uh, Google has pretty much only mapped South Africa, so we'll, so we'll go with South Africa, I think. Although they. Pro they may have mapped some of the cities in the places. We'll go with. Uh, I guess. Cape Town? Longfooting? Yeah, Cape Town. Because Longfooting is where J.R.R. Tolkien was born, fun fact. Uh, yeah. Boom Street. Uh, no, I I'm better off trying to find a city name than to look for a specific street in the cities. Um, to have a little bit of you know a, a hero moment, to like grab at something. Up, make a guess. All right. Well, I, that was far off. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah, thought that was the Kenya flag. I feel silly now. I didn't see uh, any any flags, but I, I did notice some French influenced words and whatnot. So um, that pointed me towards South Africa, and I eventually found some um, other language. I don't know if it was Swazi or what, but um, that was a tough one. I, I I guess South Africa at Cape Town, but I wasn't 
confident in it. I got 2098. What'd you do, Al? I was killed by a Woolworth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I saw that too. I got 608 points. You can guess where I guessed. Yeah, that's hilarious. I was killed by a Woolsworth. In the east. Uh, Matt, how'd you do? Yeah, the Woolsworth for me. Um, I, I ran into a bunch of different languages, not just French and probably Swazi, but I just trusted Tulkas and got 1815. <laughs> see, see, now it looks like I was the genius, you know, throwing you off the scent, you know? Because I proclaimed Kenya, and you would never have suspected me. Yeah, I, I, I'm genius. How'd you do, Tulkas? I, I want to be praised. Praise me, Fixer. Praise me. Not if you guessed in Kenya. I, I did not guess in Kenya, so praise me. Where'd you guess? I, I guessed Cape Town. Oh, same place as me? How many points? 2,090. You're, you're going to try to get off without get praising me, aren't you? Well, I beat you by eight points, so shouldn't you be praising me? Okay, you are a very smart person, Fixer, and I am in awe of your brilliance. Oh, that sounds so genuine. All right, next round. Everybody ready? Yes. 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 All right, three, two, one, go. Oh, that sounds so genuine. Uh, sea World, that this ain't uh, Florida. Um, could be Florida. I mean, this it looks Greek. That, that's yeah, that's Greek. Uh, or Russian, but no, that that that's it's Greek. Okay, I'm glad we had this experience together, where we both decided that it was Greek. And yay, I could I could have read that out, you know, because I know Greek. But well, I don't know Greek. But if I did know Greek, well, just don't don't mind me. Hellenic, yeah, that, that that's Greek. Uh, uh, when I were free, one euro per amper. The Euron. Oh, Bank of Cyprus. Well, that's helpful. Uh, the uh, there there is a a Turkish half and a French and a Greek half in Cyprus, and I believe. Um, one of these is one, one, and the other one is the other. Probably this one. Um, along the coast. Paya. Kupro. Ku. Ku. Kumpro. Where is Kumpro? Kumpro. Come, come to talk with Kumpro. Um, because. Of, it looks like there are Greek names on both sides of the border, so I don't know. Um, it, because I know there's like tensions over there, so there's like a UN, Betty, or something. I don't don't know that as thoroughly as I would like. Um, Hotel Atlantis. Uh, Minoan Mines. Who Minos has asked his ears? Um, it'd be suck if it was like a, a bank of Cyprus and that was randomly on the mainland. I don't think Cyprus is economically stable enough for that, though. Alright, so it seemed pretty fairly obviously Greek to me, and I guess near Athens where all those shipping lanes are. So I got 2553. How'd you do, Al? I thought it was Cyrillic, so I guess Bulgaria. Oh boy. But I got 2303. Is it actually in Greece or is it in Albania? I can't tell. Well, that's that, a Grecian island. That, that was Greek, the language. How I didn't see the loopies that I usually see in Greek, though. So. Well, I've had. Yeah, like, I thought two it was Cyrillic, Greek. too, and put it in the Ukraine. Got 2008 points. Talkus? Fortunately, Tolkos has had two years of Greek, and so Tolkos immediately recognized it as Greek. And also, fortunately, there was a sign for, like, saying Hellenic and stuff. Uh, unfortunately, Tolkos found a sign saying, uh, quote, Bank of Cyprus. And I, I assumed that the Bank of Cyprus was probably not solvent enough to be doing, uh, you know, transactions outside of Cyprus, seeing as uh, Cyprus had to be bailed out by the EU or something. So, uh, Torx guessed Cyprus for 2113. Nice. So, that was right. annoying. Let's see what our final scores are. I got 15,216. How'd you do, Al? 15,043. Oh, that was so close, man. Even with the bad Africa guess. <laughs> uh, 15,824. Oh, damn. 
Pentalkus? This is the ultimate shield gather of ultimate destiny. Goodbye, scab guys, and explosions, and Matt in the hat. Uh, two zero six one four. What? What'd you get? Two zero six one four. Oh damn! Yeah, at first I thought you said two zero six four. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, how the hell did you get that low of a score? <laughs> I I try. <laughs> All right, so it looks like Talkus is our weekly champion. Well done, Woo! sir. Congratulations. I like how we're still calling it Weekly Champion. Like, that was actually a good round considering our lowest score was over 15,000. Yeah, yeah, so, definitely. I, a lot of interesting places, too. But, but like, it's a thing, like, you know, like half a year ago, Fixer derped and said Weekly Champion instead of our Seed Champion or whatever. Now we've just, like, inducted it into the, the GeoGether mythos, and no one even thinks about it anymore. We just think it's natural, you know, to be the Weekly Champion. It's so meta. Yeah. So meta. All right, if you guys played it wrong, put your scores in the comments below. We'd like to see how you did. And if you'd like to make a challenge for us, go to geocetter.com. That's G-E-O-S-E-T-T-R.com. Make a challenge. Um, try to come up with something unique. Don't do, like, all islands or anything like that. Come up with some unique places. We like to see different types of places. So thank you for watching. Interesting vistas. Yeah, there you go. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. See you guys next time.